Hey, welcome to Cheap Eats. I'm Steve. I'm Ralph. And we're going on a road trip today. And I don't know who's going to drive, we'll figure that out. But first, we're going to go to Hawaii, which is really Culver City. And we're going to go to Rutt's Hut. I don't know who the heck Rutt is. Next stop, El Segundo, the farm stand. We're going to sit outside. We're going to watch the planes take off from LAX, have some gluten-free, great organic stuff. Boy, you're talking an awful lot, because I'm going to the big chill after that. Big chill in Westwood, and we're gonna eat that yogurt, and I'm gonna learn how to make yogurt. It's frozen, it's good. You, you, you already know how to eat yogurt. Right, let's get out of here and get going. Let's I'm start ready now. To Breakfast. Eat. I'm here with Michelle. Hey, Michelle, how are you? Hi, good. Good. And Oscar? And I see that you've got, well, what do you have? Hawaiian bread with cinnamon and powder. Who's Rutt? And where is he? Rutt? Uh, it's a Hawaiian. This place has been here for a long time. I don't know. I'm assuming it's the owner. You think? Yeah. Well, maybe we'll find out later. Okay. All right. Enjoy your French toast. <laughs> Thank you. We're in the center of love. Rutt's kitchen. This is where all the secret stuff is made. And I'm here with the head guy, Mr. Rutt. So, Paul Baba. Well, who's Rutt? Rutt is an old Hawaiian name that came from New Jersey. This sounds like the mafia <laughs> moving <laughs> into Culver City. Does the chief know that? The chief knows, everyone knows about it. <laughs> and you're open seven days a week here, as I understand it. Seven yeah. days a week, breakfast, and, lunch, and, and dinner. You could smell the great food from the street. Oh, we got the Kahlua cooking early in the morning with the cha Oh, that big pork <laughs> stuff is unbelievable. Oh. Everything's made homemade from scratch. And we got the recipe from the old Hawaiian family who left me with the secret recipe. I think it'd be fun to make the royal. You want to do that? Oh, let's do it. Oh, let's, let's do a make Hawaiian, it happen. Original Hawaiian royal. We so use the Portuguese work. sausage. Then what? And then we put some cha su. Okay. This is what you get the original Hawaiian royal. After it cooks a little bit, we add some veggies and whatever fresh vegetables they choose. It usually comes with beans, broths, and onion. More stuff. Oh, oh. Let's see you flip it. Go, baby, go. Oh! <laughs> And what are we putting on now? We're going to put three, uh, three scrambled Let's eggs do over it. Man, I am starving. Let's go. Well, you do that a lot better than I do. The locals would like the eggs just slightly soft. Okay, so let's do it. And you have three three sizes. You got. We have junior, regular, and king size. And this is what junior. This is your regular size. Okay, let's put it down on the plate now. And right. this is how we serve our royale. Hey guys, uh, I'm looking at this picture and it says Rutt's Hut. First question, who's Rutt? That's the thing that we don't know. Nobody knows? Nobody knows, nobody asks. But you've, you've been here before, right? Oh yeah, the old heart, that one. You, you've even been to this one? Yeah. This was like ancient history. Yeah, we used to come every day. Every <laughs> single day. Is the food delicious here? Yeah, oh yeah. What's your favorite? They're all my favorites. Well, you guys enjoy your breakfast. Thank you. Thank you very much. Wow, this wow. is fantastic. Sitting in the tiki room with the trade winds blowing this, and, the, and the you, aroma, oh my God. And you know, they, they have catering at four bucks a head. This is amazing. This is a mixed plate. Mixed plate? Ooh. And this is the Hawaiian Royale. Hawaiian Royale. And we've got Kahlua pork and cabbage, yeah. yeah. I see rice also, and this is uh, pork. Simon soup, right. Fantastic, and that's uh, Portuguese sausage and sunny side up. I want to try this pork. And I'm going to try this, the Royale. Oh my goodness. Mm. Oh, you know that the the, um, mm. wait, wait, the bean sprouts very very oh. uh, crunchy. It's good. This is really good pork. But let me tell you what I discovered. What? I know who Rudd is. No, you don't. It's me. That's scary. Let's eat. Oh yeah, let's do that. Mm. Oh my goodness! Lord. You know, next time I want to drive. Well, you got the helmet already. Mm. Well, well, we're, we're, all guys do rule. You better believe it. So, well, we're on Main Street. In El Segundo. We're, yeah, we're right up from City Hall. I see LAX off in the distance, and across the street is... The Farm Stand. You Urban know? Country Food. And it, I know it's delicious. I, I can't wait to get over there. What, 
I want to eat, so you watch the bike, and I'm going to the farm. Oh, we'll go both. Go, come on. Sylvie, what what's going on here? It's wonderful. What is it? <laughs> what's farm stand? We call it urban country food, and we um, created it because we are we melded our foods together. My background, my husband's background. We created farm stand to represent. Country life and the city life. Okay, we're in El Segundo, and yeah. I feel like we're on the wild side because of this place and the food. I think that your food meets all those goals, and I would only ask you one thing. Whatever you're doing, keep it up, because you're doing it right. Thank you. Hey, everybody. We're in the, uh, the kitchen at the farm stand. This is where urban country food begins. And I'm with Alex, who owns and uh, as the chef here. What we're gonna do now, we, uh, we have a chicken breast uh, yeah. here. I'm gonna cut it and slice it. As soon as we slice it, we uh, also I cut it again. I so they, uh, so our customer, they don't have to use the knife to cut it. What are we gonna call this when it's done? But I, I call it lemon chicken here. Okay. Uh, and uh, because I'm gonna marinate it with the lemon, a okay. little bit of uh, onion, uh, salt and pepper, and a little bit of saffron. Take the chicken, right. uh, skewer, and leave them on the plate. Okay. And uh, we can walk back there towards barbecue. Okay. My dad and my mom Persian, Persian. and my grandmother Russian. So uh -huh. I'm, I'm mixed up different countries. So that's yeah. why I learned different way of cooking. So uh, now this is how like, are we doing with that? This is uh, I call it Turkish because Turkish uh, people they create this first. Move the chicken here so your finger doesn't burn. Good idea. So now you can go ahead and squeeze the lemon all over the chicken. We're gonna serve it with the uh, um, roasted tomato. It's the same way we could put a, we put the tomato on the skewer. We cook it and we, we have vegetables here. Okay. So then so what this we all do comes together. together, yeah, all in right. the plate. Nobody knows about this place, so let's keep it a secret. So you've been here about ten or twenty times, huh? At least. What? Do you, why? Why here? Yeah. First of all, it's close. It's local. Uh, you like to be in the middle of the town, in a quiet location. And the food, they have different experience here. You find things that's a little bit different than other places. Sitting outside in the sun on the main street of El Segundo, and you can almost hear a pin drop. This is quaint. This is like Iowa in 1950. Here it comes, baby. This is what you've been waiting for. OK, Stephen, this is the lemon chicken that yours truly, that's me, made in the kitchen a few minutes ago. Well, you, you know got to try it. You know what I'm going to do? I am going to try it. You know, I hate to say this. Yes? But your cooking <laughs> has gotten much better. This chicken has such great flavor to it. I it, had a little help. It, 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 the seasoning on it, it, I mean, it doesn't taste like it's like chicken. This uh, tastes like, like it's love. <laughs> It is delicious. For an afternoon, and, and this is and lunch. It, and it's out here in the urban countryside in the middle of America, El Segundo, on Main Street. Hey, Silly, thank you very much. we got to go back on our road trip because we're going for frozen yogurt. But we'll be back here again. You have a wonderful, wonderful place, and I can talk and eat at the same time. Thank you so much. It was such a pleasure to have you. Thank you so much. See you later, Big Blue Bus. Thanks for the ride, guys. That was very nice. Good, good ride. You know, we're going to the Big Chill where they make those great big, big yogurt pies. Yeah. So well, let's get some for the bus driver. Sounds great. But we got to find the same driver. <laughs> Carry in the back room behind all the yogurt machines, and we're going to make yogurt, frozen yogurt, the best in Los Angeles. So, Carrie, what do we do? We're going to make wow cow today. Wow cow. Yeah. Woo! We're going to pour the mix Ooh. in the water. Okay. And look, look at all this stuff coming up. Yep. Oh wow. And you're going to start whisking. Whisking. Keep whisking. So let's pour some. Uh, flavoring in Ooh, it's peanut no. butter today. Peanut butter. I eat this yogurt all the time. And I always thought it was just the machine. But it's really made here secretly in the back. These secret ingredients. This is like chemistry. Uh, uh, now what do I do? Oi. Oi. I'm not in the union. OK. She's got the heavy end. I got the yogurt end. We're going to put it in there. We're putting it right in Carrie, here. There's no way I can do that. Maybe All right, let's watch. I'll watch you, and then okay. I'll do it the next time. All right. That's how it's done. Wow. 
Oh, we're making magic. I can just hear the machine doing all this stuff. Let's give it a try. The texture. That's the peanut butter we just made. Oh, we just made this. Can you believe this? Frozen yogurt. Delicious. I love my job. I'm at the Big Chill, and uh, everybody here works here except me. The yogurt certainly works. I saw you behind the counter, <laughs> so I know you know how to do this stuff. Who can tell me what yogurts I have in front of me? Strawberry, custard, vanilla, and chocolate. You know, Carrie and I were talking about how I could have all of this yogurt and not put on 100 pounds. In fact, not have any calories at all. How do we do that? It's our secret. It's a secret. And you're not going to tell me the secret? No way. Diane, you're going to tell me the secret? No way. Well, okay, I got Caitlin. Caitlin will tell me, right? Nice try. <laughs> well, you know what? I'll bet you're all tired of having yogurt all the time, right? No? No. Okay, well, let's have some. Come on, here it is. What about me? Hey everybody, uh, we're in line here for yogurt uh, and um, I'm standing behind Carol. Carol, how are you? I'm great, how are you? I'm good. This is your first time here, right? No, it's not my first time. Like it's far from my life. Like first you've been time. coming here for how long? Since they pretty much opened, I think. Well, they pretty much opened about 20 years ago. That's how long I've been coming here. Well, that's uh, it must be good. So it's the best yogurt. I love the consistency. Um, I always get this side by side, like two flavors yeah. next to each other, right. and take a little bit of each. It's funny because I'm lactose intolerant, and you know now they have all kinds of yogurt yes. where yes. there's no dairy right. and no carbs. Right. But at the beginning they didn't. You know, they, they have a flavor line. I don't know if you knew about this, but no, you can I don't. call on, the, on by telephone and find out what flavors of the day they have. You can do the same thing on online as oh, well. That's great. I think that's fantastic. Well, let's get back in line. We'll, oh, of uh, course. We'll okay. get our yogurt. All right. Thanks. Nice to talk to nice you. Nice to talk to you too. All right. Okay. Bye bye. We're making a yogurt pie. Yogurt pie. My goodness gracious. Which is a couple layers of yogurt. You pick out the flavors, and it's custom made. And then we put any toppings you want in it. Wow, this is the greatest secret of the Big Chill. It came out great. You did a wonderful job. Oh, you're just too kind, because I'm taking this with me. Okay. <laughs> what a fabulous road trip today. Oh yeah, we ate our way all the way through West Los Angeles, uh -huh. and uh, El Segundo, and Culver City. Starting with uh, Rutt's Hut, Rutt's Hawaiian food, fantastic. I mean, the breakfast, and the chasu, and the Kahlua pork, and the, it's great. And then, of course, the farm stand, a little bit of middle American in, in El Segundo, right past LAX. Fantastic, fresh farm food. And here we are at the Big Chill. Olympic and Westwood, fantastic. Maybe the best yogurt in the whole world. Oh, we got the frozen yogurt pie. Oh, yeah. The guys in blue. Let's do it. And you know what the question of the day is? Who is Rut? My ride home. Let's do it.